Alright, hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to tie a tournament shock lead knot. Um, sorry, we haven't uploaded recently, the weather's been bad, not, not been able to get fish and make any good content, and I've had a few mishaps with cameras and stuff, so. But here we are, so you're going to need your mainline monofilament, this is Shakespeare Beta. Saltwater monofilament, 18 pounds, 0.369 millimeters in diameter, and some Rovex 10x extra heavy duty. Any other shock leader. This is 100 meters of 60 pound, or 0.70 millimeters in diameter. All right, so here you got your main line. This is 18 pound. Here you got your shock leader this is 60 pound so first you want to put them both together so one on top of the other, the other. next you take your shock lead leader or the heavier line and what I do if it's for use of just a general beach rod is I just tie a single granny knot and then that should do what I like to do is I put another I go through once again and then you just pull that a bit there you go so now with the main line pull off a few inches of that and what, what, what you do is you double back on itself just like this and the tag here is behind both pieces of line and then you go under and through under and through under and through under and through four turns should be enough now you want to pull that down a bit then you pull them together this isn't completely tight yet and now you want to wet the knot so wet the knot pull on the tag end and the shock leader so you pull that double granny really tight tight as it can go and then you pull it up to the uh, grin and knot in the main line pull that tight and then you can pull on the main line leader pull until that's really tight and there you go then I'll trim the tag ends so trim the tags really close one and two and there you got a really small lead leader knot it'll fly through rod rings especially on a mop plier rod just general beach rod you've got your main line here shock leader there so now you shouldn't snap off yeah it's a really easy to tie leader knot I re recommend it for clean ground because it's not as strong as other leader knots like the Albright knot of a Bimini hitch but if you just fish over clean ground for average sized fish in UK waters, let's say dogs, whiting, codling, bass, whatever that'll do fine, it's not going to fail you unless you get snagged and yeah, it's a really easy tie, good lead or not I'm Brody, thanks for watching Cormel Angling Productions hope you enjoy the video, keep fishing